Hello everyone, welcome back to my kitchen. So today we are going to be making Chili Colorado. This recipe was um, given to me by a friend who said, being I tend to like Mexican dishes, this should be really good and I should like it. So I want to thank all my returning viewers for the support that you've given my channels. And for the new viewers, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my dishes. So let's grab our aprons, let's get our ingredients, and let's get started. For our chili colorado, we're going to need 10 guajillo peppers, and forgive me if I pronounce that wrong, 2 ancho peppers, onion, garlic, salt, cumin, pork butt cubed, oil, chicken broth, and bay leaf. So the first thing we need to do is cut up our pork butt into bite-sized pieces. And we're going to cut these in, I'd say probably about one inch, one inch pieces. Something about that size. So now that we've got our pork butt all chopped up, what we're going to need to do is remove the stems and the seeds out of all our peppers. And we're going to be a little bit careful with this because we don't want these seeds going everywhere. So we're just going to you know, pull out the stems and then cut them in half and then just get rid of the seeds that are in them. Like so. So we've got us about two cups of water heating up over a medium high heat. And to this we're going to add in our dried chili. and half an onion which I've quartered up and we're going to let this come up to a boil and then we're going to reduce it to a simmer and cover it and let it seep for about 20 minutes. Alright so our chilies have been simmering in our water for about 20 minutes. And so now we're going to transfer these over to a blender or a food processor. Now we need to be careful because this is very hot. And there we go. And to this we're going to add in our cumin and our salt. And we're going to give it a couple of pulses to get it started. This is what we want. So now we're going to move over and start getting our meat ready. So we've got uh, some oil heated up in a large Dutch oven over a medium high. And to this we're going to add in our pork.
And what we're going to do is we're going to cook this till the pork is no longer pink, which will be about 10 minutes or so. So this has been cooking for about 10 minutes and the pork is no longer pink. So to this, we are going to add in our onions and some salt. And we're going to cook this about another five to 10 minutes also. So this has been going about 10 minutes. So to this, we are going to add in our chicken broth. Our sauce, which was all our chiles. And after I made this, I realized that I forgot to add in my garlic with this. So what I've done is I'm adding in about a teaspoon of minced garlic along with my bay leaves. So we're going to give this a good mix. this come up to a boil and then we are going to put a lid on this and then let it simmer for about 45 minutes. So this has been going for 45 minutes and so now we're going to let this continue to simmer for 15 minutes uncovered. So this has been simmering uncovered for 15 minutes and as you can see the sauce is thickened so now we're going to serve us up a bowl of chili colorado. So now that our chili colorado is done let's give it a taste. So it smells delicious. Enjoy cooking in the kitchen. Until next time.